we first moved here together in February 2019. My wife went to visit uh, her family in Switzerland, but unfortunately her flight was cancelled, so she just um, missed being back in time. My partner and I went to the same school. We've known each other for almost 30 years, I'd say. And he was due to travel in May, but then lockdown happened and um, his visa lapsed. When I decided to go to New Zealand, um, he decided to stay in Russia and he planned to come to New Zealand maybe in three, four months. He had the last request from the immigration um, in early March, 19th of March, the borders were closed. So the assessment process stopped. We wanted to start a new life, start a family and just settle down. We then arranged everything and for all our furniture and our small dog to move across to New Zealand. And then unfortunately, um, the COVID-19 um, outbreak happened across the globe. Where we allow movie crew, yachtsmen, fishermen, nothing against them personally, but we don't allow partners and families into the country. So it completely goes against the mindset of an actual New Zealander. And I've known people who are here for 10, 12 years who are not by legal terms called citizens, but our lives are here. Um, as far as I'm concerned, we are New Zealanders too. We do unite against COVID, right? So, so yeah, we have to unite everyone. If it's unite against COVID, it's unite all the families. I would just like to tell her to just hold on there and stay strong, and we'll, we'll see each other soon. It was in Russian. <laughs> Meaning, I love you, but he knows it. I have that kind of hope in my heart that yes, my love will be with me, will be with me uh, very soon. And that's what I, I keep saying to her. And that hope is what is keeping our love alive. It's almost like I can't even remember time without her. Yeah, but it's all good. I wish you back soon. <laughs>